Hi, I'm Bob Stovall. Welcome to our video today on WP Properties Plugin. And what we're going to cover today is um, how to list a property in the WP Property Plugin and how to update one there. So what we're going to do first is we're going to show you how to update a listing that already exists. Now if you're using the WP Property Plugin, you're going to have an entry over on the left here that says Properties. And when you roll over it, it's going to have all properties, add property, etc., etc. And what you want to click on right now is all properties because we're going to edit one that already exists. And what we're going to do is take this first one right here. And let me go back to the listing. And you're going to see that we have a price of 69.9 on that. We're going to change that. We're going to make a today's going to be a bargain. We're going to knock $500 off that price. So we're going to make it 69.4. We're going to click update. Now you can change anything in here while you're doing that. So um, anything that you change in those settings will appear when you reload. Okay, so here you go. Let's reload the page. And you can see that we've changed the price here to 69.4. So that's all there is to doing an edit of an existing listing. Now let's talk about a new listing. To add a listing, all you have to do is go over here and either click Add Properties, or you can click Add Properties up here. Or if you're somewhere else, and let's do that. Let's go somewhere else. Let another page load. And if you're on another page somewhere, you can just pull down to Properties, and this little pop-up comes up over here, and you can just click Add Property there as well. Okay, so what we're going to do is this one you want to add a title in here, and then you want to add a description and add some of this stuff. And I'm going to show you what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to All Properties because I want to show you a trick. If you do this and then save it as a draft, be careful here because what it does is then I've had people looking for their drafts and they can't find them. So if you've saved your, gotten part way through your listing and saved it as a draft, here's what you have to do. Come back over here and either click All to see everything or click Draft. I'm going to click All, Filter Results, and we're going to get our draft back. See, here's our draft down here. You have one auto draft and we have one here. So what we're going to do here is click Edit. And we have the title. We have a description. You can, of course, write a better one than I did right there. Very important down here is to write something in that, you, that Google can use to actually locate that on a map because it's going to create a map for your listing. Your price, your bedrooms, your baths, all any of this information down here that you want to fill in. Okay. And when you're ready, you can just preview it. So here's what it looks like. This is what the listing looks like right now. Okay, and we added some pictures. And I'm going to show you how to add a picture in one second. And here's your the Google map that it did for you. So you have a nice little listing there. Now we're going to go back and I'm going to show you if you want to add an image, just click add media right here. And you go over here and grab a couple of files. I'm just going to grab one because we already have one up there. Um, let me grab this one. Uh, that's a Photoshop file. Uh, it's a map. All right, let's throw this up here. This is a plat of the property. We already have some pictures up there. And it uploads it for you. And now um, you can create a title right here. I'm just going to use this, copy this one, paste it into the alt text. You can create better ones. I would use the address here. Um, that might be what people search for. Or maybe a, a brief description of the home using keywords that you know people search for in your area for houses. And after that, we're just going to say, okay, we got that, got that, got that. All right, we're good. And we're going to take a look at it again, preview it. Only takes a second to preview every time, and it keeps you from making mistakes. But there's the new picture we put in, the plat. See, right down here. Plat, the two pictures we had in there before. Okay. That little red P that pops up there is to pin it to Pinterest. Okay, that's a plugin in Firefox. So we're going to go back. We're satisfied now. We like the way this listing looks. You come back here. You come over on the right over here and click the blue publish button. And then we're going to go to Chrome, which has our listings page open. And we're going to have a look. And there you go. There's the new listing. Click on it and it opens the listing for you. And that's all there is to that. So I hope this video, you find this video helpful. 
and thank you for watching this video today. For more videos, head on over to our YouTube channel. There's a link to it on WPForRealEstate.com. There's a link to it on OrangeCat.com. There's a list to it, link to it in several other locations. So just head on over there and 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 watch our videos. Uh, hope you have a